Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Rock Forcing TV. Today we are continuing our episode exploring United States and we are at Tempe, Arizona State University, popularly known as ASU. This university has about 150,000 students with about 38,000 online student and guess what it has a very beautiful uh, com campus and we are about to explore it today this is one of the three universities in arizona that is governed by arizona state board of regent and my oh my today you are going to explore and see things for yourself Oh yeah, behind me is the university house and on my right side is the university tower. That is the parking lot for the students and right here is the visitor's parking as you can all see. So ladies and gentlemen, follow me and let's go and explore ASU.
Hello everyone, my name is Pamela, Pamela Pia, and I'm from Kumasi in Ghana, the Osei Krom, Osei Krom, you know. <laughs> yes, and I'm here in ASC Arizona State University studying biomedical engineering. Yes, and one of the experiences or one of the things that I would like to share about my stay here so far is one thing I love about Arizona is the sun. Though I know a lot of people would disagree with me, but I love the sun a lot. And one other thing too I like about Arizona is, or the ASU too, is the educational system. It's free, it's open. You can just walk up to your professors and then tell them whatever that you have on your mind. So it's like you, they expect you to come to them and then you come to them then you tell them what you have. And I see that as a great thing uh, or a great quality here in ASU. And for my shout outs or my greetings, I would like to say, uh, well, I've missed all these people, but well, <laughs> shout outs to my mom, my grandma, my family, my friends, BME class of 2021, congratulations, you guys have done so, 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 so well. To my friends in Pensacay and USD, my church in Ghana. I just want to say greetings to you all and hi. I hope you are all doing well and I'm just hoping that maybe we'll meet here one day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my name is Bafo Kwesi Osei. Um, my Bafo is spelled differently, my Osei is spelled differently. Oh, I'm a different special person. So, yeah, so I'm from Ghana, from um, the Eastern region, Koforidua, the best region in Ghana, uh, you do, I know it's the best. I say Chrome, don't even come. So, <laughs> yeah, so um, I'm reading civil engineering and then I'm majoring in structural engineering. And one thing I like about Arizona is the infrastructure, the place is great. This place is amazing. The road system, everything is so connected. The first day, I was I saw people walking, crossing the road, and they were just walking majestically when the car was waiting. In Ghana, you can't do that. <laughs> no! <laughs> they will insult you. But over here, the pedestrians, they respect them. Once you step on the road, all cars will respect and stop for you. It's amazing. The educational system is so great. The lectures are so open. They are so free. You can call them any anytime, anywhere. They will respond. They are willing to help. They even encourage us to even ask questions and all that the place is amazing yeah so um shout out to my family my mom dad and my sisters my friends um civil engineering class of 2021 congratulations you did great the time we spent together was so amazing yeah i love you all yeah hello everyone i'm grace i'm from Domi, 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 Domi Kwabinya Taifa. Oh, my party's day. Hello, hi. It's your girl, Grace. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm also offering biomedical engineering. Um, I'm looking forward to neural engineering. So if you know anyone, yeah, reach out to me, okay? Yeah, please. My stay here has been awesome. One thing I can say for sure is the academic system is very engaging. Like they approach real life situations. So a simple running, a simple jogging, you find um, you find scenarios that like it's been you're applying the knowledge you gained in class and not just learning junk thing like what we used to do. Because I remember some things I learned and then like. I don't know what, how I'm applying it. I don't know why, uh, even why or how I'm applying it. But over here, everything is engaging. Your research is not just going or just doing a, a math problem or like a, a, an answer which is open. Like everything is engaging. That's all I can say. So it, it, it opens your mind. It's very intriguing. It opens your mind. It makes you very intellectual. Um, you, you are an analytical about everything you you come across and then try to apply whatever you learned in class and that's one thing that I find amusing and interesting over here. Shout out to my family, my sister Prilla. Shout out to my friends, Sylvia Lauren, Mary, um, Insia, Pensa KNESC, BME badge of 2021. We love you from the BME squad here. We love you so much. Congrats on your graduation. You've done so awesome. Like incredibly well yeah so 
Bye. I'll see you sometime later. Okay? <laughs> You'll be coming here soon. It's too much. Every second. Every second yeah, not playing playing them. <laughs> yeah, so hello everyone. Um, my name is Natefe Imano. I'm from the Vota region of Ghana. I'm studying business analytics here in Arizona State University. And um, so far, I would say it's been great. Um, I get to um, talk to my lecturers anytime you know I have any doubts about a particular program or course and also I get to have fun with friends I get to go to um, games every single day or I would say every single week right and then um, I would like to give a shout out to my friends and my family back home in Ghana and I would say that I love, I love you all and keep pushing and keep praying Hi everyone, my name is Emanuela Tego and I'm also here studying biomedical engineering. Yeah, so um, I'm from Ghana as well, from Tema specifically. Yeah, TM is the best place you could ever be. So let's, let's, we know, like, you all will refuse to agree. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Like, if, if, should we mention celebrities from Ghana? Like, should we start? Should we start? Okay. Anyway, anyway, so let's come back to what I like about ASU. My stay here has been so great. It's been nice. We've learned a lot so far. At least I can say that for myself. And what I want to say I really admire about ASU is that they are interested in you going holistically, not just in your research, not just in the classes, but you going in every aspect, your social life, your economic life, financial, every single thing. And I believe because of this, they've put all the resources in place for you to reach out. You will not struggle on your own. If you are struggling with this, you can turn left, turn right, and you find so many resources to help you with it. So I, I think this is a good thing. I want one thing also I admire about them is their time management. If it's time for learning, it's time for learning. If it's time for enjoyment, it's time for enjoyment. And I believe we all were not going like we didn't go with that. And I believe it's a good thing to do. Know when you know what you should do at what particular time for you going holistically. So I think that's one thing I really admire about them. And shout out to my family, my friends. Class of BME 2021, CCFKNUST. Oh my God, I miss you guys. So thank you so much and see you another time. Bye for now. <laughs> All right, that's from our, our, our brethren from Ghana, Ghanaian student over here. Did you, did you hear what they said? They said every minute we are no, play, 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 every minute. All right, all right, guys. So, question, quick question, one question. I'm not sure who, who's going to answer. Um, if you should advise our brethren back home, we want to come here for studies. What, what's the best advice do you want to give it to them? Who's going to go? Okay, Grace, go first. <laughs> What I would like to say is you should know what you are going in for. Um, it's it's cut across. Just know what you are going in for. You don't want to commit your time, your resources to something that in the end you find yourself, like you, you question yourself about whatever you committed yourself to. It becomes questionable of everything you do for that. So even though the resources are available, they are easily accessible, like, like, any time, any moment, you can just get a resource and then it helps you know what you are going in for. Don't just be on the, any opportunity you just want to grab. Not everything seems at, as it is, but they know what you are going in for. It helps for you to know and then like, strategize for the goal that you, you are working towards. That's all I have to say. Yes, for my people back home to who are also planning on studying here in the US one thing I would like to tell you is yes indeed the pasture is green they are greener pastures here I mean when when we were in Ghana we used to hear it oh America they are they are they are system near yeah, Juma 24 7 you see and it's true Yes, CN are playing back with Bavichum. Yes. I mean system no is 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 really working. It's seriously working. But the thing is the fact that the system is working doesn't mean if you come here everything will go on smoothly without doing much. You there's a lot to be done. You have to put in a lot of effort. I mean they are the the pastures are indeed green. They are very green and ripe. But you have to put on your hard working shoes so that you'll be able to be successful here in the US because it's not easy. There are a lot of things to be done. When you come here, oh you just go and read okay, when we were in Ghana too, you see here that 
because of our system in Ghana, when you come to the US, you can easily succeed. No, no. You got to put in a lot of work. Like, hey, it's a scam. Yes. We are looking for the person who said that. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes. So you still have to do more. You have to work hard, even as you have gotten the opportunity or even if you get the opportunity. And one other thing too is, you can do it. You can do it. Just believe in yourself. Apply. Pray to God. And hope that everything will be okay. And yes, just put on your hard working shoes. And this place would be a great place to be. Okay. Actually, they've said most of the things. But I just want to add my voice and say that do not be intimidated. Just do your research. Because as they also said, you, because the, the pastures are good, the resources are there, you can advance in something that you want to do. The opportunity will be there. But if, if the going gets tough and that's not really what you want to do, you realize that there's no motivation. You end up quitting or something like that. So do your research. Know what you want to do. If possible, find people in the field that you want to go into and reach out to them. Just as they, they've said, you can reach out to anyone. Once they see through email, they can reply. Pa, 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 and do your network, do your connection. If possible, and when you come here, hopefully I'm sure that everything will work out fine. Because if you are not hardworking, I don't believe you'll get here. So keep on the hardworking, don't get intimidated, do your research, and you'll be good. Okay, so I would like to add that you should be strategic, you should be proactive, and also know what you want. Yeah. Okay, so they've said everything, and mine is just a caution. I just want you to be aware that in the U.S., um, the examination and MSM is different from Ghana. You know, way back in Ghana, you could relax and wait till mid-semester or final exams, and then 70% you go and write, get 65 plus MSM, and then you are good to go. Here, no, 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 no. Attendance and every single mass contributions. Sometimes just appearing in the Zoom meeting alone we just gives every single mark is important and <laughs> so much weight is not placed on MSM and then final exam so even if you don't do so well in the exams or MSM you can still get an A because if only you've worked so hard in the assignments and exams and all those things yeah so that's something you have to keep in mind when you come here yes every single mark is as important as an examination mark yeah thank you gonna be fine. all right they've said it all they said you can make it just do do your 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 your, your i mean your 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 research your homework and then you can make it by the way these are all uh, master's level students so i mean you can do it this is rock Force tv you are watching don't forget to subscribe and share all right, say bye-bye. <laughs>